Welcome back to Destiny. This is Greg29407. Once again, we're here with our Titan Tad. And he is now level 8. He's still uh, as silly looking as he was. But um, last time we left, I had him at, he just hit level 6. And uh, we had done that fourth mission. What I did in the meantime was I ran a few uh, patrol missions on Earth. And uh, basically, I, I did a bunch of missions, uh, very simple ones, and I picked up some new armor. Um, a little bit more advanced stuff, which is nice. So I pulled my light level up to 27. And what I also did was I bought some more special ammo and heavy ammo bullets just in case I need them. And in terms of, I did those bounties that we had picked up. So I did those and got some, uh, I got the two, uh, two more levels of experience pretty fast. So that wasn't too hard. Um, so now I think we're about ready to do our next mission. Our next mission is, is uh, the final of the, the main missions on Earth. Here's where I did the patrols. Um, remember we've, done, we've done the other missions already here, and this one, the last array. We got this mission after we finished the, the one we did previously, which is the War Mind. So this is a level 6 story. We need to track down codes to raise an ancient array and connect its long-lost colonies throughout the solar system. So let's go ahead and do this one. This one is uh, a little tough at the end. You get three waves of uh, big enemies. So I wanted to get a little higher level before we, we started this one. I've done this mission a lot of times. So preparation is really key for all these missions. If you're used to doing them, then you're a little bit better at them. But uh, when I first started this game, it was really tough. team of Guardians went dark near the old Skywatch. They were running a mission for dead orbit, had codes to a hidden array that could reconnect us to the other colonies in the system. If we can find their ghosts, maybe we can open that array. Yeah, so this mission was really tough the first few times I did it. I mean, like, oh boy. Hopefully this time will be a lot easier. We'll see. The ghosts were last heard from near the Skywatch. Let's head there and see if we can find them. All right, we gotta go back to that Skywatch again. Remember, that's where we went before. Nice. All right, let's take care of it. Let's not. So again, we're going to retrace some steps that we've done before. This may look familiar from our last time. We're we'll out of time. Yeah, let's move that guy off. Okay. I'm also going to show you another one of those gold chests that we've got some more free stuff. Breeding ground. The vanguard say they're spilling onto the surface now, keeping the fallen busy. There's a gold chest I forgot to show. Uh, we've already done. We've collected three of the five so far, so I'll show you where the fourth one is here in a few minutes.
Took his head off. Nice. I didn't completely miss that one <laughs> totally. <laughs> Take it easy here. No sense to hurry up. No reason to hurry through this at all. Okay. They're all hiding in that little room. bullets or tougher bullets. Ah, oh, Okay, let me show where that fourth golden chest is. It's right up here. Jump up here. There we go. Oh, we got a new gun. Let's see what it is. Hey, a new pulse rifle. 30 bullets. Nice. More stability. More tank. We'll take that for sure. And we also have a fusion rifle. That's a 42. So it's, uh, it's right up there. It's really nice. I like that shotgun still, though. Oh, and but I was also uh, doing those those missions earlier. We had a rocket launcher, but now I also have a machine gun. So let's uh, let's equip that. One. That does some pretty good damage too. Okay. Go back down here. Let's continue on. The ghosts, they're in a clearing between buildings not far from here. Nice sights. Okay. The ghosts are still here. Fallen half of Okay. Okay, so we need to find ghosts that have been stolen by the fallen. Oh, jeez, that's a high level guy. Nothing. Find another one. This one still holds the codes. There we go. Good. Let's find the array. Okay, so we got the the uh, the codes.
Like you just left your head sticking out like that. Punch me in the face. Okay. Now this is where it gets a little hairy. Approaching the control station. This is it. where we need to move around a little bit. See if there's any more bullets I can pick up here. Okay. There's a little tricky part up here where they're gonna send some invisible guys in after us. Yeah, you suck. If you're not ready for those guys, it's a bad surprise. I'm not trying to make a rhyme. Okay, you're gonna be slow and steady, slow and steady. Okay. There's the controls. I'll see if these codes still work. I don't want to hit those controls. I only have 133 bullets. Let's see if I can find some more bullets here. There we go. 224 is better. Anything else I may have missed? I'm a stickler for bullets. I hate running out of bullets in these gamma games. There we go. 315. I like that. It is the most frustrating thing in the world to be doing really well in one of these missions and suddenly you get no bullets. Now, this is a room we're going to do a lot of battles in. Hiding behind this big round thing is probably the best bet. you got to move around the whole time in this in this fight. These guys are going to be coming through that doorway right there. A big ship's going to come and, and land them. And we're going to fight these guys. We're not going to be able to reload fast enough, so we're going to have to start retreating farther and farther back and then using this and then some of these boxes is, uh, to block uh, the enemies. Eventually, there's going to be a couple of wizards that come out here, which we need to do a good job on. And finally, we're going to have like a yellow guy that comes in. Um, I've tried to hide behind this box before. That's a big mistake because you can't see him coming. So this is going to be a wild one. I'm not going to guarantee full life on this one. Let's see. Okay, I've got my shield ready. Let's see. 
I got that fully loaded. I got that fully loaded. All right. Okay. Negotiating crypto systems. Sure, resistance security lattice verified. It's working. Outside the array. It's opening. Oh, guy, put on a machine gun. It's connecting to defense constructs all across the system. There could be something out there to help us survive the darkness. All right. Yeah. So we got an auto rifle and some gauntlets. I think we'll head back to the uh, the tower to turn in all this stuff. All right, we're on. 
have the tower. Let's see what we've got here. These predate your codices. They predate them. good weapon. Be careful. Yeah. What did the Cryptar give us? Well, I got a lot of stuff. Okay. Uh, this is our pulse rifle we've got. Auto rifle. Pulse rifle, low level. We can get rid of this now. Hand cannon, that's good. And then another auto rifle. So we can get rid of this auto rifle. And a scout rifle. Hey, we got one of each now. Scout, auto, hand cannon. Pulse rifle, of course, is the lowest one. Let me uh, upgrade it. Maybe we'll switch over to the hand cannon for a little. Eh. I'll stick with what we got. All right, over here. 42. Yeah, we'll take that. Get rid of that one. 143. Yeah, this one's got strength. Let's upgrade this. And then this one's a 40, we got a 30, a 40, and a 42. That's got strength though, so let's keep that one. Get rid of that one. When I was doing my uh, patrols earlier, I got a blue thing. I have to be level 12 before I can use it though, so that's much better than what I've got otherwise. All right, and I'm gonna go talk to uh, Ikora. See what she has to say, and then we'll finish up for this round. We are so close to level nine. Ah, a little bit more, a little sliver more. Something brought them together. Evening. Thank you. Oh. Ah, I think we just leveled up. Watch yourself out here. Yay! And then we just got to talk to this guy. Good. Careful. Yeah, give me some points too. Yeah, ah, look, as we get a, a, our own weapon. Well, they're not as good as what we already have. Machine gun. Rocket launcher, two bullets though. I wouldn't mind having that. All right, let's take that. Very well done. Stand firm. I really like these rocket launchers. And get rid of the old one. And we'll equip the new one. And we can upgrade this. While inside the Ward of Dawn, you and your allies gain significant damage resistance. Sounds good. Oh, it's not letting me do it. There we go. All right. So easy to lose. Alrighty, we have done all the. Uh, the first uh, Earth missions. So we will see what we're going to do next. But we will call this an end right now. So until next time, uh, this is Greg29407. Uh, hoping to see you again soon.